Yo, what is down everyone? As you saw in that introduction, we got the black sparkle time fedora. Now let's calculate how much I gave for it and let's see how much it's valued at. So the JJ top hat is, I'm pretty sure it's like 85 to 90k. I'm going to say 85k because, you know, there's a sale king coming up soon and that's going to drop like all the high demand things and JJ is pretty high demand. So 85 clockwork headphones, those have been doing really bad recently. So thank God I got rid of it. That's 90k. It used to be like 105. I had it when it was 105 and I held it until it reached 90, so I lost 15,000 for doing nothing. It kind of sucks. Then we gave the classic fedora, which is 60k. It's, you know, the sale's gonna drop it. it, it I, I used to value it at 65k, but you know, the sale's gonna drop it by a bit. And then the green band top hat, that's 8k. So that's 243,000 for the black sparkle time fedora. And I'm pretty sure the black sparkle time fedora is valued at 250,000. So if we take that away, that's 7,000 profit. And we upgraded, which honestly isn't that bad. And also in this episode, I'm going to be going over over a hundred trades that I have inbound. So let's check them all out. We have a load and it's going to take forever to go through them. So I'm going to skip through all of the boring ones. So this one right here isn't too bad. We're giving the super, super happy face, which is super high demand, 5k value and the neon bombastic, which is about like one to 1.5k value, super high demand for the ultimate pink victory, which is about six to seven K value. Mm, pretty decently high demand and at the moment the ultimate pink victory is selling for under wraps so that's not a good sign so i think i'm gonna decline it it's not that bad of a deal but i don't mm, actually you know what let's accept it yo this guy wants my gold cutout shades those are mine okay i have a special thing that i'm gonna do with those and i'm not gonna tell you yo this guy right here wants my brand new black sparkle time fedora let's see what he's offering the clockwork headphones the classic fedora and the void star 85,000. that's nowhere near enough yo this trade right here okay the ne neon green beautiful hair is like 6k value super high demand the head row is like four to four point maybe 5k value decent demand and the chill cap oh my gosh that's gonna go up a lot i have like over 150 of them right now it's tempting because of the chill cap but at the same time nah 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 nah, nah. can't do that Yo, this trade right here isn't even that bad. This guy wants my green man top hat. He's offering the super, super happy face, which is 5k. The beautiful hair, the space edition one, which I think is 2k, so that's 7k right there. The merry laser and the ring of fedora, those are 1k each. So this right here is 9k for 8k high, high demand. He is offering some high demand items, but at the same time, I'm trying to upgrade right now, and upgrading is like, you get less items. And in this case, we're getting four items for one. It's not, nah, that's downgrading. So I'm gonna decline that. Not a bad offer though. He could probably get the green man top hat. Yo, this guy wants one of my Velks. Now I have four Velk helms. It's sort of an unintentional horde, if you even want to call it a horde, uh, a horde, you know? They're, they're like 55,000 each, so yeah, they're, they're kind of expensive. I, I call it a horde. So let's try and let's hope this guy takes one of them because I don't, I don't want four of them. That's a little too many. So he's offering the police hat, which I think is 9k, the dual venom shanks, which I guess 30 to 35. Uh, the dual venom shanks are more like 30,000 and then the light student, I'm pretty sure that's like 2k. And then the red series scarface, that's like 2.5, maybe 2. That's not even 45k, bruh. Good luck getting Velk. Yo, what the heck? Okay. Now this may look good, but you know what? The Breeze Creek Adventure is actually projected and before its projection, it was about like 300, so... This would actually be a loss if I were to accept it. And it's already selling for under wrap eight times. So it's not look looking too good for the Breeze Creek. If I want, I could accept this trade and then quickly try and trade it off for like 1.5k value. But you know what? I'm gonna pass. Here we go. We got another decent trade on the Green Man Top Hat. This guy's sending the Super Super Happy Face, which is 5k. The Tea Kettle, which is 2.5. That's 7.5k. And then two Chill Caps, those are 500 each. So that is, I think, 8.5k. That is not too bad. But again, it is a downgrade, so I, I, I need to upgrade. I gotta get some pretty big items for the series, you know? So I'm gonna have to decline that. That, that, was, that was a pretty good offer, though. Oh, here we go. Another trade on the Black Sparkle Time Fedora. Let's see. Clockwork Headphones, that's 90k. Uh, Velk, that's 55. And the Fuchsia Fantastique, that's 105, maybe 110. All that. I'm not too sure about that. It's all value it above. So that's 255k. That's not bad, to be honest. That is... Uh, I may consider this. Honestly, Valk drops like crazy during sales, so this might hit like 50k value whenever the, what's it called, the midnight sale happens. And the clockwork headphones recently have been dropping like crazy, and I don't know, this isn't too bad of a deal, but I'm um, still gonna decline it. Ooh, this trade right here, okay. The classic fedora for the Valk 1v1, okay. Valk is gonna drop like crazy due to the sale. Same with the classic fedora though, they're both gonna drop like crazy. 
But I already have four Valks and one Classic Fedora, so I'm, I'm gonna decline that. I don't want more Valks. Okay, this one right here, this guy's offering the Endless Ice Slasher for the Valk, and he's also adding in the Angelic Face, which are, those are two pretty low demand items. The uh, Immortal Sword is like 40k value, 40 to 45 I guess, and the Angelic is like 9k. It's pretty much the wrap. So that's like 54,000. For 55,000 to 60,000, it's super high demand, and he's giving low demand. This is... Not a good deal. Oh, Dominus Vespertilio. Okay, I, I could already tell that this trade is bad, but let's just go over it anyway. This guy wants my Black Sparkle Time Fedora and the Valkelm for his Dominus Vest. Honestly, not many people like it. It, it always gets, it's, it's like the Trash Bag Dominus. That's its nickname. Like each Dominus has their nickname. The Aureus, the golden one, is called the Golden Toilet. The Praefectus is called Acne or like Pimples or, yeah. Each one has its own thing. So I'm giving 250 plus 55 to 60 which is 305k for like, I think Vesp or Trash Bag is, I think 280k or 290k, I don't, I don't really know, but it's, I'm definitely overpaying by way too much. Oh, here's a pretty big trade, okay, this guy wants my Velk, which I'm willing to give away, you know, I have four of them, I don't need that many. Well, as I say that, I have like 150 chill caps, uh, <laughs> let's see, he's offering the Winter Conjurer, which I don't really know the value of it, to be honest. I guess 25k, he's also giving the bucket, which is about six or 7k the midnight blue shaggy which is about like maybe 23 24 23 24 all valued at 23 and then the noob assist which is like nothing so that's 55.5k honestly i don't i could probably get a better offer and i have like four of them so if i trade them all off for 55k then i'm losing 20k because i can wait like a few weeks after the sale and then it'll go back up to 60k and if i trade now for 55k and if i trade all four of them that's 20k that's five times four Valkelms, that's 20. That's actually a lot, so I'm gonna decline this. I gotta get like 60K each. Oh, this trade's interesting. Okay, the Classic Fedora 60K plus Valk 55K, that's 115. And he's offering the Black Iron King of the Night, which is like 23K. Clockwork headphones, which are 90. And then the Perfectly, which is about like maybe six. So I'm actually gaining 4K value, but you know, once the Valk goes up in like a few weeks, I'm gonna be losing 1K, so. Oh yeah, and the Classic Fedora might go up by 5K as well, so I'm gonna be losing 6k so i don't know it's not too bad of a deal to be honest like right now it's not too bad but in the future it's gonna be pretty bad pretty bad and my clockworks headphones are doing so bad right now so i'm gonna pass not a bad offer though and you know what let's actually counter his trade i kind of want to upgrade so i may as well go for like the black iron king of the night and i'll send him this which is 6k value this which is like eight this which is six so that's 20k and then i've got to add 3k I'm gonna toss this in, which is 5k value, so I'll, I'll have to make him add like 2k, so maybe like 3 of these, I don't know. So yeah, let's send that, and hopefully he accepts. Yo, oh, here's another trade for the Clockworks' his headphones. This, I wouldn't even give Voidstar 1v1, come on. What? I'm getting one Robux for free, should I do it? I don't know about it, you know what, now nah, I've got to decline. I know he doesn't take donations, he likes to make his money. Oh, here's an interesting one, okay. So the Sparkle Time Fedora, the yellow one, has been doing really good recently, so I don't know, just hit th like 300,000 value, so I'm giving my Black Sparkle Time, which is 250, and my Classic Fedora, which is 60, that's 310 for 300 raising, so this is really risky and I, I don't know what to do, you know what, I'm gonna hold on to it, oh wait, it expires in 4 hours. You know what, let's counter it and let's make him add the ultimate pink victory. If he does that, then we're gonna have a deal. And you know what? How about I get rid of the ultimate pink victory and I do a Valk instead of the classic fedora and then I put this. So I'm overpaying by 5k here and I'm getting rid of like my Valk. One of my 10 billion Valks. So let's do that. And hopefully he accepts. That'll be pretty good. Oh, this trade right here, I'm giving 8k plus. No, that's mine. Cuddly Krakens are mine. Yo! He accepted it. Wait, what? He actually did it. Ah, he's bald now. He doesn't have hair. Exposed. No hair. I got the Sparkle Time Fedora, though. I still overpaid in that trade by quite a bit, but honestly, this has been doing really good, and if it goes up to 310, then profit. And this is also, like, one of my favorite Sparkle Time Fedoras because it's yellow, and noobs are yellow. So yeah, let's make a new outfit. Let's take everything off. Let's toss it on. Oh, yeah. 
I'm gonna toss on the work clock shades and the work clock headphones with it. That should be a pretty cool combo. There you go. The pink wistful wink. I like the wistful wink. The void star. Yo, that's gonna look so good. Oh, yeah. For gear, let's toss on the Midas glove. And then for the shirt, let's see. I have the yellow sparkle time right here. The iNewbie t shirt. Yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, turn on those notifications, and I'll see you next time. Yeah.